everybody. Today I'd like to share with you my newest achievement. This is a MacBook Pro that runs four operating systems at the same time. It runs 10.6, 10.7, Windows 7, and Windows XP. Now, why would I want all this? It gives me opportunities of not have to carrying four different computers. So here is Windows XP. <coughs> now all this is running off of the same computer. There are tricks that I had to do to this computer to get it to um, start up. All the operating systems are fully functional. I'm running two boot camps, one for Windows 7, one for Windows XP. The Windows 7 runs a boot camp, or I should say OS 10.7 runs a boot camp for Windows 7, and OS 10.6 runs a boot camp for Windows XP. Here we have Windows XP loading. There you go. And truthfully, the speed of the computer is amazing, even though there is quite a bit of load on there. So let's get this restarted. <coughs> All the operating systems are fully functional, nothing hacked. Uh, the 10.7 does run. Um, fully functional version of cloud. Alright, so let's do 10.7, which is Lion. The computer is slightly modified inside to accommodate all this. Um, there is a problem trying to boot Windows 7 and Windows XP that I had to solve. So here's Lion. Let's restart it. It is possible to pick a default startup disk. However, you cannot pick a default for Windows 7. To start Windows 7, it has to be done through a trick. Here we have the Snow Leopard, and uh, having all these operating systems allows me to run some of the older programs parallel to the newer programs on the same computer without having to... So now we're going to be loading Windows 7. As you can see, there is fewer options when you load Windows 7. That is the trick that I was talking about. You have to tell the computer that Windows XP doesn't exist.
here we have full-blown version of Windows 7. Uh, there is also a nice utility for the start menu, which I was looking to change on the Windows because I don't like the one that it comes with. And uh, I'm sure you can find it online. It's really neat. Well, thank you for your time, and good luck.